Hi students, this animation and description would help you to learn physics even more easier and better. So please do watch it and enjoy learning physics. Long Distance Power Transmission The electric power generated in a power station situated in a remote place is transmitted to different regions for domestic and industrial use. For long distance transmission, power lines are made of conducting material like aluminium. There is always some power loss associated with these lines. If I is the current through the wire, and R the resistance, a considerable amount of electric power, I square R is dissipated as heat. Hence the power at the receiving end will be much lesser than the actual power generated. However, by transmitting the electrical energy at a higher voltage, the power loss can be controlled as it is evident from the following two cases. Case 1. A power of 11,000 watts is transmitted at 220 volts. Power P is equal to V into I. Therefore, I is equal to P by V. It is equal to 11,000 by 220. It is equal to 50 amperes. If R is the resistance of live wires, power loss is equal to I square R. It is equal to 50 square R. Is equal to 2500 into R watts. Case 2. 11,000 watts power is transmitted at 22,000 volts. Therefore, I is equal to P by V is equal to 11,000 by 22,000 is equal to 0 0.5 amperes. Power loss is equal to I square R is equal to 0 0.5 square R is equal to 0 0.25 into R watts. Hence, it is evident that if power is transmitted at a higher voltage, the loss of energy in the form of heat can be considerably reduced. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe this channel for more videos.